Now, if I were someone who just walked up to you on the street and had never heard of Dixon Place, and I said, what is Dixon Place? What would you tell me? I'd say that it's a nonprofit organization that um, presents theater, music, dance, performance art, literature, puppetry, burlesque, circus arts, and visual art. That's probably what I'd say. We do 14 shows a week. We do shows here in the lounge, uh, in this bar area, every night, and then we do sometimes two shows in the theater. So it ends up being um, really crazy and really fun. I was able to start making really ambitious stuff here when there was virtually no reason for a theater to say yes to me. You can just be starting out with no credits, no uh, resume, and Dixon Place will likely let you do outrageous, ridiculous things here. That fan base will accrue organically if you make consistently good work over the years. I'm the artistic director of a company called the Apothete, uh, which is a company dedicated to uh, the production of full-length plays that explore and illuminate what I'm terming the disabled experience. And we did our very first production here at Dixon Place. And just the fact that they were willing to meet me on that level because a lot of people will talk the talk. Um, but here at Dixon Place, they actually followed through. And I was a new company, just starting out. They didn't really know me from Adam. You know, and they said yes. Everything is encouraged here. I've seen dance pieces, you know, Spanish scarf pieces, magicians, puppetry, ventriloquism. Yeah. It, everything is celebrated. And it's not because this or that is the fashion. Mm -hmm. I think because of that, it's not, um, to me it feels, I feel more at peace here. It's not just only straight theater with a very particular aesthetic and it, it gives me more license as an artist to challenge my own work in that way. When you come here the works all in dialogue with each other because the audience is coming back over and over again and the audience is in dialogue with the performers and the performers are in dialogue with the audience and the shows are in dialogue with each other and it's this like real organic uh, theater going experience. I don't know if it sounds cliche, but I am so inspired by the artists that work here, the way they work, and the work itself. I'm really in awe of what they do, and it's like rejuvenating. If I've had a really hard day or I'm really exhausted, I can go into the theater and it's just rejuvenating.